Hey y'all, iRick Sky here. Gonna do a quick unboxing of the iPad Air. And you can expand this video's description and then click the link there and you can find where to order it online. Apologize for my hands. I cut my hands with a pocket chainsaw. So they're kind of chopped up. But without further ado, let's get into the box. See what we got here. That nice little tab you can grab and then you can you can rip your rip your plastic wrap, your shrink wrap. Feeling like Trump. Let's see, there we go. There. Can I open a box? I'd hope so, because this is an unboxing video. Woohoo! There we go. We've got the box, we've got the iPad Air. And it's in a little protective thing, which is nice. Then we got this right here, which is... Oh, we have a sticker in here, man. Ooh! We don't have a sticker. We got those stickers. Two stickers, man. Two stickers. And then we got a... Mmm. Mmm. USB-C to USB-C. USB-C is in Charlie. And then we got this... Mmm. A very slick, sleek looking USB wall charger. I'm going to put this back in the box because I got so many USB C cables already, man. I don't even want the cable clutter. I'm going put to this, put this over here for now. Now, something I always do, and this is an added bonus uh, for this unboxing video, I never touch a device with my grubby hands until I put it in a proper, until I put a proper screen protector on it. So I'm grabbing my screen protector right now. We're gonna put this on. And again, expand this video's description and click the link there and you can find the type of uh, screen protector like I'm using. Um, you know, I'd never wanna to touch a device with my grubby hands. So I've got these right here and you can find them linked within this video's description. Just to, I felt it was an affordable option, but it's it seems to be of good quality. Good quality, you know, something that you don't want those cheap plastic ones, man. They'll they just get that they're not smooth, you know, when you're trying to do your thing. Um, I'm gonna pull one of these out. And let's see, I don't think, yeah, let's see, I got three of them. Ah, so if I really mess these up making sure my hands are clean. Uh, something you may want to do is blow off your table. Keep, get that dust out of the way there, man. Okay, so we got this. We got our screen protector. Again, never, never touch a device with your grubby hands. Um, Okay, that says back. So that's the back side. Okay, so that's the side that's gonna go down on the device. So now I'm gonna stop talking. There's a little speck on there so I can talk again. I'm just gonna do a clean wipe. This screen protector that I got came with little wipes. That's nice, man. It had a little bit of, a few dust spots on there. I want this thing to be pristine. So I don't want any grubby fingerprints on this device.
Just testing it. Don't want to talk because I don't want to spit on it. Perfect. You never want to rush that. You just want to take your time, make sure it's well aligned. Because otherwise it's going to drive you bonky. And I mean, actually, you know, you honestly, you can, uh, you can remove and reattach one of these screen protectors, no problem. But you just want to make sure you've got all the dust off. You want to make sure you're in a, in a clean environment. You want to minimize your finger touches underneath the thing because you don't want fingers to show through. These bubbles should come out with time. Um, but yeah, I feel like I got that very well aligned. Um, hmm. You know what's funny? Once these bubbles go away, which they should in a day or so, I won't even be able to tell this thing's on there, man. That's how good it looks. So y'all saw me attach it, man. Did I, did I do a good job? Did I do a, a poor job? What would you have done better when you were attaching your... 
Oh, I got a little piece of dust. Ugh! It's a tiny piece of dust. I see those little pieces of dust will drive you crazy because when you're looking at your iPad, you'll see them. But the question is, does the piece of dust bother you more or does a scratch on the actual iPad's screen bother you more? Would you rather have a dust particle between your screen protector and your iPad's glass or would you rather have a scratch on your iPad screen? Comment below and tell me what you think. But yeah, this is it, man. I got the, I got the little. Uh, oh, that's nice. Got the, the cover on, and th this is the blue color. It's kind of cool. Obviously, I'm gonna put it in a case because I don't want to damage my awesome iPad Air. But yeah, I'm impressed. And that that glass feels good. It's slick. That's what you want. You know those those plastic screen protectors. They get get kind of that kind of a smudgy feel when you're moving your thumb or finger around and it's just not a good feeling. I'm going to be using an Apple Pencil with this and this is compatible with the Apple Pencil. So there you have it. Uh, thanks for your viewership. Be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash guy. This was just the iPad Air version 4 unboxing and I gave you the added excitement of attaching a screen protector. So you can find the iPad and the screen protector linked within this video's description. Thanks for your viewership, and y'all have a good day. Hey, y'all. Captain Irix Guy here. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to subscribe. It's youtube.com forward slash Irix Guy. And ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership, and y'all have a good day.